All right, I kind of made a pseudo promise to my little sister about not driving and videotaping at the same time when I'm cruising the streets of Oshkosh, Nina, or any other city in the Fox cities of Wisconsin. But here I am again. I really don't have a choice in the matter. I, I want to make sure that I make uh, a video every day that's important to me and it's part of my life. And when work takes over and it's overtime season, this might be the only time of day that I really have to uh, make a video cruising the streets of uh, Highway A here is about, eh, it's a straight stretch and I think I'll be safe. It's not like I'm watching uh, the road through the little uh, camera. I'm actually like just holding uh, the camera in my right hand and just driving. And every once in a while I flip it around to get a little bit of the scenery of the grandeur of Highway A. Now see that sign there? It said, I don't know if, I was hoping that Maybe I was driving too fast, but this is Highway Y. And the reason I want to get Highway Y on film is because I got to work with a man that I refer to as Mr. Handsome, make a good at everything. He worked overtime with me on my overtime shift last night on the youth services unit, and it was really good seeing him. He's one of those guys that, eh, you know, kind of uh, know each other and talk to each other but I wouldn't say we're friends but if that was to change I would not be a sad guy because he is a, he's a man of quality and he got to show that quality today we had a bad emergency on the unit and he took over he took command and I was very impressed with his uh, delegating authority skills when the chips were down that's the good stuff right there so it was a crazy overtime shift, one that I won't soon forget. And uh, I'll probably talk more about the letter Y and why Y is important uh, for me at another time. Uh, I might have to talk about the ugly notebook that I made uh, for that gentleman, Mr. Handsome McGood at everything. I just don't write uh, ladies uh, with these ugly notebooks. I know that seems weird, but I write guys probably just as much as I do the ladies, which is just kind of weird. So, all right, I'm hoping I make it home in one piece and don't have an accident because uh, when you work overtime, you don't get much time for videotaping or sleep.